Chow here, welcome to another edition of Peter Chow's Weekly Lose Roundup. Let's get to it. Movie 40 feet open nationwide today, and I can't tell you how excited I am to see this movie. Of course, I am notorious for my party shit mouth, but I like it when the movie has this much swearing, but also has so much star power. The movie has Harry Berry, hot, Kate Winslet, hot, Kristen Bear, hot, Naomi Watts, hot, Uma Furman, old but still hot, Emma Stone, hot. Johnny Locksbeer, Johnny Locksbeer, and of course, Nick Raffin. Of course, you can see for yourself and join the fun and check out the trailer by clicking the annotation right there. In other news, Rance Armstrong turned down the chance to be on Dancing with the Stars, to which the other cast members let out a huge sigh of relief when they weren't gonna have to dance their feet off to compete with a raging steroid junkie. Studio exec materials were also happy that they didn't have to change the lamp of the show to Dancing with the Dope Annex. It's a tie for this week's video of the week. You guys have two choices. John Apatow's wife praying with Megan Fox's boobs. Oh, I would put floodlights on them. I mean, they've... <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. <laughs> or Kate Upton being Kate Upton. Usually I do this at the end of the video, but right now I want you guys to sound off in the underpenny section below. Who is hotter, Megan Fox or Kate Upton? While you're at it, give this video a boom thumbs up, answer the question, and one of you will receive a free $100 Amazon gift card. Justin Bieber has been dumped by Serena Gomez because he got high on the marijuana mara and had a sexual feast with a young nurse. To which I say, good for you, Justin Bieber. Fuck the haters. Apparently, his next single is going to go something like this. All I need is a lessie's pussy to feast to make my life complete. The lamb of the list is Mimi Jensen, a nursing student who he took back to his house last month and went dirty on her downstairs. A source revealed that Justin told her, I want to know if you taste good, which is I guess how the beans talk dirty, because that's what I say to my fly lights before a hearty, but not a mirror. Anyway, he started to kiss her entire body without taking his own clothes off, keeping in mind that she's completely naked at this point. And after a little bit, the nurse just got a little bit freaked out and just laughed. To which female bereavers all around the world said, WTF bitch, you ref? OMG, how could you? You don't know how lucky you are, bitch. Speaking of Justin Bieber, he has officially passed Lady Gaga in Twitter followers. So I guess this... Oh, I love it! What the fuck is wrong with you? Is officially better than this. Uh, what the fuck are you wearing on your face? Speaking of nurses, a 61-year-old male nurse was caught having sex with a dead corpse in a California hospital. No joke, that's just disgusting. Marvel Studios want both Jim Carrey and Adam Sandler to provide their voices for a new animation project about raccoons. I guess Marvel wants to spend a bajillion dollars on raccoons that sound like Jim Carrey and Adam Sandler. Apple will launch two new iPhones in 2013. feet. One with several new color options to which the 12 year old girls and all of us said, Are you serious? New colors? Yay! And a second cheaper iPhone for the Jews. And of course, rounding out the loot is Tampon Girl, you know, the wet-ass bitch who pulled a used tampon out of her vagina and then put it in her mouth. Is it fake or is it not fake? I say it's not fake because everybody in the world knows that there aren't any blood clots in cranberry juice. Well, that's it for this week's Weekly Loose Roundup. I hope you enjoyed the show. And as always, remember, like this video, subscribe to my channel. I post new videos every Wednesday and Friday, which means I will see you right back here on Wednesday. Until then, stop checking the hatering and stop checking the bounty. Ciao, motherfucker. If you were my mother, bitch.